Kosovo's police force move in after a polling station in Mitrovica was attacked by masked men. Armed with stones and tear gas, they force it to close early. They started smashing ballot boxes, throwing ballot papers around, insulting members of the election commission, and one older woman was seriously injured because one of the attackers hit her with a chair. These elections, organized by the Pristina government, brokered by the EU, were the first covering the entire territory of Kosovo. Serbia officially backed the vote, hoping it would smooth their path to EU membership, but getting voters on side proved to be difficult. Hardline Serbs in the north of Kosovo had fought a tense campaign, calling for a boycott of the vote. Earlier in the day, in a southern part of the divided city of Kosovska Mitrovica, a steady influx of people entered a polling station to vote on who would be their next mayor. These elections are very important for Kosovo. Europe is asking for democratic elections and it's a big plus that they're being held in the north as well. But just a short walk over the infamous Mitrovica bridge towards the northern part of the city, the picture is very different. Many people there refuse to vote despite public calls from both Belgrade and Pristina because they feel that these are not their elections. Empty ballot boxes and election commissioned officials keen to avoid the cameras. This scene is typical of voting stations across northern Kosovo, where Serbs constitute a majority. Anti-election campaigners were in front of every polling station in North Mitrovica, hackling the few who decided to vote. We are boycotting these elections because the so-called state of Kosovo is organizing them. We are not recognizing its independence and we never will. These elections are the way for incorporating us into so-called Greater Albania. And that boycott appears to have been successful in the Serb-dominated north. Preliminary official data shows that turnout was low. The question now is what effect will this have on integration of the north with the rest of Kosovo? Alyosha Milenkovic, Aljazeera, Kosovska Mitrovica.